A few days ago, I posted a video titled, Is Michelle Bachman a Birther? And in that video, I questioned whether Michelle Bachman actually understands what a natural born citizen is, whether she understands the eligibility issue with Barack Obama, and whether she actually understands the constitutional requirement. Well, I received flack from several of my subscribers. I was suspended from Free Republic for attempting to post a link to that video. World Net Daily posted an article in which they claimed that Michelle Bachman was talking about the long-form birth certificate and they used the very video segment that I used in my video. Well, they were totally in error. Yesterday, Michelle appeared with George Stephanopoulos, who is a strategist for the Obama administration. During the segment, George held up a copy of Barack Obama's short form, his certification of live birth, and on the screen they flashed an image from Fact Check. This image I'm showing you now. As I've pointed out many times in the past, even though other Fact Check photos do show the document has a seal on it. This one does not. Well, Michelle Bachman went on to say that she takes the president's word on this. All he has to do is present this document to be verified to the court clerk in Hawaii, and it's a done deal. Here's the clip so you can see for yourself. Michelle Bachman has no idea what the issue really is. Thanks for listening. And last night you were on Fox News suggesting the president should come forward with his birth certificate as well. You're well, and what I've said about that is I was asked the question about that, and, the, and Republicans are constantly asked to vouch for the authenticity of the birth certificate. The only one who can is the clerk of court in the county where someone is born, and that's where people should go. Don't ask Republicans. Go ask the clerk No, no, of well, court. but actually one of your supporters in the state of Iowa has put forward a bill that would require presidential candidates to... to uh, file their birth certificate with their candidacy. Do you support that? Well, Governor Jan Brewer just uh, vetoed that bill in Arizona because she felt that that was a bridge too far, that it wouldn't be up to the authenticators in each state to do that, that that would be a federal issue. There is a federal piece of legislation that hasn't gone anywhere that would also require that uh, the candidates put forward their birth certificate. I have no problem giving my birth certificate. It wouldn't bother me at all. I've got one. It's authenticated. Take it. Well, but so does the president. According to the bill, a candidate for president or vice president shall attach to and file with the affidavit, a, can a copy of the candidate's birth certificate certified by the appropriate official in the candidate's state of birth. And That's the, right. Well, I have the president's certificate right here. It's certified. It's got a certification number. It's got the registrar of the state signed. It's got a seal on it. And it says this copy serves as prima facie evidence of the fact of birth in any court proceeding. Well, then that should settle it. That, so it's over. That, well, as long as someone introduces it, I guess it's over. It's right there. Yeah, there you go. Okay, because well, that is not the main issue facing the United States right now.